Hey everyone, it's Brandon from Virtual DJ here with a tip of the day. Now a playlist is a special file that simply contains a list of songs and Virtual DJ allows you to create, save, and load your playlists at any time. You can also use Virtual DJ's auto mix feature to play and mix your playlists automatically, which is great for mobile DJs to not be stuck behind the computer during cocktail or dinner hours. Virtual DJ also allows for you to import iTunes playlists and other third-party software that saves in standard M3U playlist file type. To create a playlist in Virtual DJ, click on this button in the side view area to show the auto mix pane. Now browse your folders to look for tracks to add or search for tracks using the search bar. Drag and drop each track that you wish to add to the playlist to the auto mix pane. You can also add multiple files at once by using keyboard shortcuts Command or Control or Shift plus click to select multiple files and then drag and drop to the auto mix pane. You can also change the order of the tracks in the playlist by dragging and dropping the track up or down in the auto mix pane. Once you're satisfied with the playlist and track order, you can save this playlist by clicking on the Auto Mix Options button and click Save. Enter a name for your playlist and then click OK. Virtual DJ will now save the playlist under the Playlist folder in the left-hand folder view. Click on the Playlist folder to expand and see all of your saved playlists. Highlight the playlist to see its contents in the Center Track Browser section. In the future, when you want to load the playlist, right-click on it or control-click on a Mac and select Load in Auto Mix. Virtual DJ will now load the playlist in the original track order to the Auto Mix pane. You can also delete, rename, or perform other file operations of your playlists from this menu. Additionally, once the playlist is loaded into the Auto Mix pane, you can add, remove, change the order of the tracks, and then save the playlist to overwrite the existing one or choose to enter a new name to create a new playlist. You can also clear the playlist from the Auto Mix pane by clicking on the Auto Mix Options button and selecting Clear. Now as you work your gig, many times you will be sorting your folders by title or artist or other tag fields. Virtual DJ retains the sort preference as you navigate around from folder to folder, so you might find that when you browse your playlist that they are not in the original order. To fix this, simply right-click or control-click on a Mac on the tag header column and select Reset Sort Order. You can do this in both the Track Browser and Auto Mix panes. As you can see, creating playlists in Virtual DJ is simple and easy, and combined with the Auto Mix can allow you to go mingle with your audience instead of being stuck behind your laptop. That'll do it for this tip of the day. We hope you found it helpful. Till the next one, remember, don't stay at 1 BPM too long. Roller coaster rides can be a lot more fun.